Siri, play LA by title sign. You know what? Play The Recipe by Kendrick Lamar. Yeah, we out here, baby. That's right, I'm in LA. And we're here for community day and I'm so excited because it means, yes, I'll be able to play 2K23. So real quick, it wouldn't be a Kills Mo vlog without this, but obviously we have to have a little post -com. First things first, I literally look like Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer. It couldn't have come at a worse time, but hey, you just gotta live with your, uh, your flaws. <laughs> and finally, it's a little bit awkward because I was meant to post this vlog before 2K23 actually came out. Um, That may have not happened. So unfortunately I do talk a little bit about me playing like 2k23 early and so on now me talking about that means nothing because the game is out but just keep that in mind when i randomly say yeah we get to play the game early and stuff it's because this was like a week and a half ago anyway back to vlogging angus we're going to be back in this don't worry there's also so many other creators there htb most a lot of path guys and so on so it's going to be so much fun this is my second night here but i just haven't vlogged anything just because i've been living the experience but um we're staying on hollywood boulevard and are you ready for the view bang baby Look at that, it is so, so nice. So yeah, I'm obviously so hyped. I'm only here for four nights, but today is the day of community day. And that means I'll be able to record some content. I'll be able to get out 2K23 videos early. And obviously I didn't get out any 2K23 videos early. So a bit of a rip, but trust me, this vlog is still so much fun. So let's see if we can hit a thousand likes on it real quick. And my word, I am hyped. So anyway, let's get to the start of this day. So yes, we're here now at community day. I'm with some others right now. Wait, where are they? Let's what's go, up, let's what's go. Up? <laughs> yo, yo. So one thing I didn't know was that Kilsamoy was actually 6'7". Like, this man Absolutely. is tall. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, especially me standing at like a good six feet. <laughs> I don't know. This man's tidy, tidy. <laughs> smallest player, smallest YouTuber. <laughs> Yeah, we out here, it's absolutely fire. The event place is sick, I'll show you right now. So yeah, as you can see, this was the event venue. It was absolutely sick. We had all these drinks, food stations. We had a barber, a place where you could get this rotation video thing, the 360 video, which I love doing. And it was just a really nice atmosphere because they actually allowed us to connect with other creators in this area, rather than just sitting down and playing the game for literally like seven or eight hours straight. Which to be fair, some people did still do though. Also during community day, I ended up getting into Interviewed, which was lots of fun. I'll show you a couple clips of this as I felt like I answered the questions quite well. So I'm Angus, also known as Killsamoy, and we're here at LA Community Day. It's absolutely insane for NBA 2K23. It's so sick. So I'm from Australia. The 2K community is great there, and it's so cool to be able to represent Australia while being here with a couple of others from AZ as well. The region deserves the love, and I'm so glad to be able to provide it right here. But yes, one big thing did happen when we were at the event. HTB and I were talking, and obviously talking a little trash to each other, and I was saying, I'm not going to lose to him. And because I was so confident, I was putting money on the line. So I said to Henry, I'll give you $100 if I lose. You give me $100 if I win. So it was a $100 wager, except then he was scared and he declined it. And we ended up doing only $20. So it was still a wager, probably the first one ever of 2K23. But it was a little bit unfortunate because it was early access. We weren't able to record our live commentary or our faces. And also I only recorded the game at the start of the second quarter. So... Small brain plays by me. But anyway, we're going to get into a little bit of a post-com, which is quite interesting, but we'll get to it. So please remember while we're showing this, I, this was like our first time ever playing. So first of all, we hit that mini with Chris Middleton. I was quite happy with it. And as I said, this was the start of the second quarter. I was up by eight points, now up by 10. But HTV starts making a bit of a comeback by getting that two with Devin Booker. But Chris Middleton back to there with that three. And Giannis, this is when we realized how good this card is. He's just a monster star in every single way you can see we're just destroying kicks it out to drew holiday and we get that green animation which is just so fire Giannis, once again this is the only card you need he's such a beast and that's the only reason i went for the box look at this block that we got i don't even understand how that was possible sure then htb gives it to devin booker and does this spin move and makes an insane shot but we need a replay of this how did Giannis get to that block i don't even know but that was absolutely insane Giannis once again with the slam he kicks it to the corner. No, you can't do that. Giannis is there and he is just unreal. Sure, he gets that score right there. That's fine by me, but we're going to then get that steal with Wesley Matthews, which is exactly what we want. Bobby Portis down low, gets that slam. And now, once again, we get another three with our boy Chris Middleton, which is fire. We're now up by 20 points, which is great to see. Giannis with another slam. Back out to Wesley Matthews for the dagger. Bang. And just like that, Giannis popped off with 23 points, nine rebounds, seven assists, three steals, 
and four blocks. So I was really happy because in the end, yes, we ended up winning the $20. It wasn't a huge wager, but it was a great way to start the year. And I'm sorry, Henry, but um, give me that dub, baby. And guess what? To absolutely no surprise, I hardly vlogged. <laughs> but yeah, the event was absolutely crazy. They had this insane setup of all the consoles and we all got a station each to play NBA 2K23 early. I was able to jump into the Jordan challenges and also some quick play five on five. The My Player Builder was there too. And yeah, I can't lie, it was all pretty sick. Anyway, we're now back and I wanna show you guys what we got from this event. It's quite funny because if you saw my Vegas vlog, it's pretty much exactly the same. <laughs> because yes, we got this 2K bag that I already have. So now I've got two. It came with this drink bottle that I already have as well. But this part was actually pretty cool because they had an embroidery station at the event. And yeah, you can see me going up and basically you got a hat and then you could put the 2K logo and also your name on it. So that's what we did to get this hat right here. It's fire, hey. Anyway, then we obviously had to go out for a few drinks after. It was um a blast. Once again, I don't record much when I'm out. I suck at vlogging because I'm very much a live in the moment man. But hey, I did a little, so there you guys go. Anyway, now I'm actually about to head off to a college football game. So I won't be able to bring this camera, but I will bring my phone and add a little more to the vlog. So guess what? I'm hyped and guess what? I'll see you there. Let's get it. I've never been this hard. Bro, I have to be so quick. But yes, I was so hot in that game. It was actually insane. I think it's the hottest I've ever felt, if you can't tell. Anyway, we have to say bye to this room as I'm heading home today. But we're doing some shopping, so I might show you some stuff you never know with me vlogging. So I'll see you guys soon. And uh, I definitely didn't vlog much. We went to this outlet center where there was so many shops, but once again, it was just so hot. I actually felt like I died on this trip. Like it was, oh, it was miserably hot. Is that even a statement? I don't know. But yeah, I don't think I've ever seen sweat that much in a span of four days. But anyway, you can see now I have survived and the shopping was nice. I didn't really get too much at all, but it's just cool to be able to go around those areas and check out all the sales and so on. So I can't lie, I did really enjoy it. Now that we're in this little part though, I do want to talk about other things I did that I just didn't talk about in the vlog. So obviously we did do a lot of shopping. I didn't really buy much at all. A couple things I did buy though is I did buy quite a lot of bottles of Prime, which is such a random thing, but it's not in Australia. So I wanted to, so I imported ported it myself. That's really the main thing I bought though, as I don't really buy much in stores. So that was fine. Then also after community day, I did somewhat mention this. We went to an after party, which was so much fun because hey, 2K definitely provided the drinks. And I was mainly there with my boy Jared and also Henry. And we were having a great time. We then ended up going to the pool party. And you know, we, we got home quite late, but it was just so much fun. As it was finally cool to be able to hang out with these people that I've spoken to so much online actually in person. I know I said I went shopping, but we went to so many like shoe stores, went to Melrose and so on, did all the things that we had to do. And to be honest, the trip was a major success, except for the fact that I just got so tired. Like, I mean, so, so tired. I ended up having to upgrade myself on the flight back, which was so worth it. I slept 12 hours of the 14 hour flight and I still feel tired a week and a half later. It's because I just didn't really sleep. But this part is a little bit weird because now we're coming into current day Angus where I wanted to show you something I got. So let's get to that. So I think it's quite obvious, but I am home now and I may have just received something kind of cool. It was in the mail and um, I might need to show it to you. Gotta have a Malteser on the way. Perfect. But yes, this is it. Let's let's take it to my room. It's heavy. All right, let's take it to my room. So here it is. You can see it is quite big. Hand comparison. It's got NBA 2K23 on the side, but I want to open it up. So let's uh, let's do this. I'm doing it one-handed, so I'm sorry. But once we pull the top off, whoa, 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 we've got something. Okay, we've got this that says answer the call. What, um, what does it say? Hello, 2K family. Feel free to tag us. If you're lucky, I might. Anyway, that's a pretty cool start. But now let's take this off and see. Okay, it was stuck. No, no. It's connected. Okay. Then it looks like we've got three packages. First of all, we want to look at this poster. Thank you. Size comparison. Oh, okay. Okay. I can't really show it, but it's pretty fire as it's the Michael Jordan cover. Now we put it back and let's see what's next. Let's go this one. Ooh, there we go. Looks like this is a microphone. Hope you like my frozen plushies too. <laughs> oh, okay. I like this. We've got the Quadcast S by HyperX. Has RGBs. Can't lie. That's pretty sick. Is it better than this microphone? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> now for the the final thing. It's a bit bigger of a package. And once the sleeve is off, I still have no idea. Oh, now I've got a bit of an idea though. This is a hoodie and this looks oh. sick. We're gonna check out the hoodie after I put everything back. So here it is. Now 
looks a bit better. Let's check this baby out. Look how sick this looks though. So yes, this is the front of the hoodie. It's kind of basic. Got NBA 2K right there though. I quite like the color though. But yo, then the back is just fire. This Devin Booker thing is so sick. I need to try it on. I'll tell you what, it's comfy. Let's check it in a mirror though. Oh yeah, okay, okay, I like it. Then the back of it is obviously fire too. So yeah, you'll definitely see me wearing this hoodie as it's sick. Anyway, let's get back to this weird vlog I'm doing. So yeah, now that we're back, obviously that package was fire. And obviously community day was absolutely fire too. I know this vlog was all over the shop and my vlogs always are. This one probably more than others. But you know, I had to do it. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to smash that like button. As I said, let's see if we can get 1,000 likes. And I really think HTB and I need to do another wager soon because I guess you can say I'm 1-0 and so far. It didn't really count, but hey, we did it anyway. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you follow me on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram. And that's pretty much it. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.